Hey guys, it's Melvin7 here bringing you episode 16 of my series Who Performs Best BPL Striker Edition. This episode is the final, <coughs> so obviously this is the last episode of season 1. Um, also, if you didn't know, I am doing the 50,000 coin giveaway like in this episode, so just write in the comments uh, your gamer tag and basically saying you want the 50,000 coins. It is only for Xbox 360, so I apologise if you're on PlayStation 3, but I don't have a PlayStation 3, so I can't physically give you coins. But anyway, for a chance to win, just comment your gamer tag and say you want the 50,000 coins. Anyway, let's get straight into this and see who wins out of Jovetic and Torres. Both of these players, I highly doubt anyone thought would get to the final. I didn't. Jovetic especially, since he's beat Suarez, Rooney and Aguero. Torres has beat Sturridge, Van Persie and I can't remember the other one. Um, I think it might be in the Grado or someone, I, I can't remember. But anyway, let's just see who wins. On to game one. Okay, so that ended as a 2-2 draw. My brother was playing for the second half and yeah, he made the stupid uh, challenge with uh, Kabul. So I'll change the centre back, it shouldn't really make too much of a difference. Um, yeah, I suppose 2-2, it's okay. I mean, I'm not particularly bothered. Uh, Jovetic got a 7.6 and Torres a 7.2. So, fairly average ratings really, uh, on the game 2.
Okay, so I did lose 3-2 and I scored two on goals. The first one, it, it just ran into the ball. He wouldn't stop running. It was lagging, so I don't know. He just ran into the ball. And the second on goal, I tried to clear it, but instead he slid and uh, it went in. So I think I was very unfortunate to lose that. But anyway, it's not about the results, it's about the ratings. So Jovetic got an 8.6 and Torres a 7.8. So at the minute Jovetic is uh, winning quite comfortably but we'll see what happens in game 3. I'll show you the stats now. I had 16 shots, 10 on target. He had 3 and 1 on target. So <laughs> this is probably the most undeserved victory I've ever seen. Uh, <laughs> I was uh, very very unlucky as Kimo did perform well. Actually just before I leave I want to see if his keeper got a man of a match. Yes, he did. Well, there's a surprise, but um, yeah, we'll just head into game three then. Okay, so that ended as a 5-1 win to me, so yeah, finally a big result that goes my way. Um, yeah, well this is the last step sort of this series, obviously, so that's the very last game, and as you can see, Jovetic got a 9.5 rating and Torres an 8.8, .8, so high ratings for the last game. I think we all know who's won, and he probably does deserve it, but I'll do the... Uh, what do you call it, the match ratings after this, as always, and I'll give you my views on Torres as Jovetic and Jovetic as a partnership. Uh, he had 13 shots, 9 on target, I had 12, 7 on target, so yeah. I didn't deserve to win by that much, but there was a game where I lost by a lot that I didn't deserve to lose, so you know, 
payback, the guy was unlucky, but whatever. Not about the result, I'll get into the match review. Okay, I'm back for the review, and I have to say everything I'm going to say about these two players is very, very positive. Um, I don't know, they've just performed very, very well throughout this entire series and have done really well to get the final. I love them both. Um, in the Premier League, they are great strikers and they work so well as a partnership. They're both the same kind of player. Tall, great at heading, can dribble, great at shooting. Just They've got the whole package and for the ratings they are, like 82 and 84, you get way more. Like Honestly, they're more like 86, 87, maybe even 88 rated players. Jovetic especially is... A, honestly such a good player and for the coins I think Jovetic on Xbox costs about 12,000 and Torres only about four I think uh, I'm, I might be a bit wrong with that but they're so cheap and I've tried every single like big BPL striker and I've got to say my overall favorite is Jovetic Torres is very good but Suarez is also good and he was unlucky to go out against Jovetic but yeah, I'd say my my top four, my top four, I'd probably say are Aguero fourth, uh, Torres third, um, <laughs> Suarez. I forgot his name there. Suarez second, and Jovetic first, definitely. But anyway, I'll get under the ratings, and then we'll go over who's won this series, and then what we're gonna do for season two. So game one. Jovetic got 7.6, Torres 7.2. Game 2, Jovetic 8.6, Torres 7.8. Game 3, Jovetic 9.5, Torres 8.8. So that does mean the average match ratings were Jovetic 8.56 and Torres 7.93. So that does mean that the winner of this entire series, and he really, really does deserve it considering his opponents, is Jovetic. Honestly, he is such a surprise. Like, I remember playing with him on FIFA 13. He was a beast, so was he on FIFA 12 when he had 5-star skill. But this FIFA is better than any other FIFA I've played him with. I, d I don't know why he's so good, he just is. He's a complete player. Two footed, can head the ball, good at dribbling, four star skill, four star weak foot. He's got the complete package. And the opponents he's faced are Rooney, he beat him in round one. He beat Suarez. No, yeah, yeah. Oh god. Yes, yeah, sorry, he beat Suarez in the quarterfinals, Aguero in the semi finals, and then Torres in the final. Uh, obviously Torres has came second and he didn't perform as well in the final, uh, he did get beat by quite a distance but his overall ratings weren't too bad to be honest. I mean the other teachers were extremely high so uh, definitely a worthy winner. So this is the end of this series, Jovetic has won but as I say, like, as I've said so many times, this doesn't necessarily he mean he's the best BPL striker, he just performed better for me. Um, you might hate him and you might think someone else is better, fair enough, it doesn't determine who the best is, it just determines who performs best in three games for me. Anyway, season two, um, there's two that have came up quite a lot, uh, please comment in the comment section, like, I'll probably put two comments and just like the one which you want me to do. Um, between Syria strikers and Bundesliga strikers. Um, each one of them are in, are in my budget. Unfortunately, I can't quite afford La Liga at the minute because I don't have the money for Messi or Bale yet. Um, after I've done that, them four and... Right, sorry, sorry, I'll wear this again, right. After I've done Bundesliga, Serie A, uh, League One and La Liga, I will move on to different positions. But yeah, for Season 2, comment... Well, like my comment of Serie A or Bundesliga and whichever one has the most likes I will do and then yeah we'll move on from there but anyway if you have enjoyed please do hit that like button this is my first ever series that I've completed on YouTube and I'm very very happy with it 
I'm happy with the response from you guys, it's really really good. I think I'm on 111 subs at the time of making this video and I've had loads of positive feedback so really thank you so much. Comment for the giveaway and comment what you want for season 2. Subscribe for daily FIFA 14 content and peace.